Hello, Stephen Fry here. You're about to join me on a journey through time and space via the magic of virtual reality. This is planet Earth, 66 million years ago. Now, we've got millions of years to cover in only a few minutes, so let's get cracking, shall we? Welcome to the age of the dinosaurs. This is an Edmontosaurus. No need to be afraid, she's a herbivore. It's the cells inside the dinosaurs that are deadly. Within this enormous reptile, abnormal cells are dividing at an uncontrollable rate. Dinosaurs like this were the earliest animals known to have suffered from a disease we now call cancer. But it won't be cancer that finally kills off the dinosaurs. Let's fast forward in time. Welcome to ancient Egypt. Even more amazing than these enormous pyramids was the ancient Egyptian science and learning. They were the first people to write about cancer. Indeed, historians have found copies of papyrus which detail cases of breast cancer. But for every step forward, sometimes there are massive steps back. Let's fast forward more than 4,000 years. Welcome to 1492, and Columbus has just found America. European explorers would bring back from their travels a deadly new type of plant, tobacco. Tobacco use is the biggest preventable cause of cancer and kills more than seven million people worldwide each year. Great idea, chaps. It took over 300 years before scientists in London worked out the link between tobacco smoke and cancer. And the battle to beat cancer didn't stop there. Amazing breakthroughs made headline news. Radioactive metal radium discovered. By the time we hit the 20th century, developments in cancer treatment came thick and fast. 1902. Imperial Cancer Research Fund founded. 1942, world's first chemotherapy patient. 1979, revolution in understanding of cancer biology. 2018, dinosaur asteroid helping to defeat cancer. Remember that asteroid that wiped out the dinosaurs? Well, it contains a metal called iridium. In another incredible breakthrough, scientists from the University of Warwick in the UK and Sun Yat-sen University, China, are using this metal to kill cancer cells, leaving healthy cells undamaged. The battle to beat cancer has been millions of years in the making, and it's not over yet. So what does the future hold? Cancer Research UK's ambitions are bold. By 2034, the hope is that three in four people will survive cancer. But that can't be done without your help. With your support, we can help make cancer history forever. To give 20, 10 or 5 pounds, text STAND20 Stand 10 or Stand 5 to 70404. 100% of the money you give will fund vital cancer research.